Hi guys, my name is Brian Bees, and welcome back to Let's Play Pocket Mirror. And for all of you that haven't <coughs> that's been watching my videos but haven't subscribed, I really hope you subscribe to me and to be able to provide me some suggestions and feedbacks in the comments under my videos so that I don't know which type of games that you know or RPG or any any games or suggestions you have for me, so I'll I'll be gladly playing it for you. So now we're uh, let's see. Oh yeah, last time we chosen the correct dessert for the queen, and now we're on the dance floor. Now we're trying to get some pieces to put that uh, Mr. Fox and Miss Fox together. So. We're facing with three mirrors right here, so I'll just start with the purple mirror. Yes, they're moving, so let's go through. Hopefully nothing bad happens. Oh. Everything shattered? No way. Okay. Don't know... <laughs> you think? Huh? Ah, it's noisy. What's going on here? I don't know. What is going on here? Oh, let's see. Oh, it's the squeaky. Thank you all for attending this very special ceremony. You have all given me your best. As you know, when one of you can become my favorite couple, all the others who don't make it will be executed. Executed? Boy, she's bold. Who dares interrupt my ceremony? I, I'm just... Silence! Who are you? Where do you come from? What are you doing at my ceremony? I... I'm just looking for something. Oh, and what might that be? Am um, I looking for? Um, I'll go with something I lost. I see, that's unfortunate. Take a seat, my girl. I'll let you look for whatever it is that you lost after the ceremony. Thank you. All right, let's have a seat, I guess. Now, I shall announce the winning couple. Which is Mr. Rabbit and Mrs. Fox. Oh, that's what I meant. I need to repair Mr. Rabbit and Miss Fox, not Mr. Fox. The winner. Congratulations to the winners. You may step aside. As for all you failures, you shall be executed. She can't just murder everyone. Shoulders, march. Oh, she actually gonna do it. Wait. Farewell, my servants. You have served me well. No. Now that's that's taken care of. It's time for tea. As for you. Clean up this mess before leaving, will you? Or else... Yes, I will. Squeaky. Oh, that squeak. Alright, time to clean up, I guess. Oh. Pitch black stuff, so he uses from the desert wounds, staining their one's shiny fur. Okay, what am I cleaning up? A severed arm. Oh, just like I said, I'm trying to repair a uh, quite loose torso. Mrs. Fox and Mr. Rabbit, so I got two severed legs. Okay. 
Any more parts? Yeah, it's horrible. Uh, that's it, I guess. Unless there's some more parts in here. Nope. Okay. No other parts. Let's go back. Now, could we go back though? I'm pretty sure we could. Let's see. Yes. All right, we got some parts. Hey, from the first mirror. Now let's go to the second one. Get more parts. Oh, okay, fine. I gotta take these parts out for them to sell it down. To uh, for them that. Let's see. Let's leave it. But that's all I could find for now. It's quite all right, my girl. Thank you for your help. Glad I'm able to help you. Well, so do I still have it? I still have a fox arm. Can I leave it with you? <laughs> Wait, let me see. Could I, or could I leave it with you? Yeah. Let me check. Yes. Everything's gone. All right, let's go. Now on to the second mirror. The first is done. Now the second mirror. Let's go. Now what to expect this time? Let's see. Ha! Nope, not what I expected. What happened? I don't know. Oh, more hearts, right? Okay, two corpses lay on a pool of bloody stuffing. Although they're completely torn apart, their hands are still joined in a firm grip. Are they only hands? I'm pretty sure. There are more parts, right? Right? Parts? Got parts? Alright, let's see. Nope. Eat. Pumpkin don't have parts. I think. Okay. Gas rear leg. Uh, any other parts around here? Let's see. You? Nope. You? Nope. Okay, here, no part, okay, let's check in there, parts, parts, are there parts, what, oh, oh, it's Miss Fox, oh, I need parts, oh, do you know where I could get parts, come on, there's something strange inside, don't you dare get me into the guards, Uh, is there anyone looking for me out there? I don't know. I desperately need your help. You're the only one who can help me. All right. I need to go outside and come back to tell me what's going on. Can you do that? Okay, I'll try. I sure will, Mrs. Fox. But I need more parts. Oh, okay. Let's see what's going on. Don't get our way. Energy orders. Okay. You? Nope. Same thing. Ah, same thing. How about you? You? Nope. Same thing. How about you? Hey, miss. What are you doing here? I. I'll just. Little girl like yourself shouldn't be worrying around in a place like this. I'm sorry, I just. We're looking for a fugitive dancer. Oh. Have you seen her by any chance? Are you talking about Mrs. Fox? Mrs. Fox? Well, she didn't want me to, but... Oh, fugitive, huh? I'll just go with... Yes, I have. See what happens. Have? Where is she? Inside the cabinet in the tea room. Guards, you hurt her. Please don't hurt her. Yeah, I just don't hurt her. But, uh... Okay. Hopefully that's the right choice I made. Alright, let's see. Hold on. There you are, you murderer. So she was the murderer. You 
Traitor, why did you get me in? I... I'll never forgive you. <laughs> Our work here is done, man. Let's go back to report to Queen Angelette. I'm sorry. But wait a minute. I think I needed to do that too. Because I think she has parts. Yeah, severe arm. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I'm so sorry. I just need the parts. Alright. I think I gathered all the parts. Yeah, let's just go back. All right, third mirror. Well, I need to drop off the parts first. What? Wait, I can't go back? Hold on, I'm forgetting part, am I? Hmm. Where, what am I forgetting? Part? Okay, I forgot a loose torso, dang. I thought I got everything, but I didn't. All right, now it works, right? Yes. Ah, okay. Handy mirror. All right, let's drop this off, though. Drop it off. Drop it off. Come on. Keep dancing, yeah, guys. I'm just dropping off some parts. Nope. I guess I gotta drop here. Then I guess. Yeah. Let me check. Yes, everything is dropped off. All right, let's go. Do 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 do. All right, blue one now. Do 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 blue. Yeah, let's go. All right, <laughs> let's see what's behind the door. Let's go. Oh, more parts. Yes. What's going on here? Hey, you. And what might a young girl like yourself be doing here? Can you see there's a very important investigation going on right now? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just... Oh well, doesn't really matter to be honest. Tell me now, do you happen to know how to read? Yes, I do. Great. Then could you please read this riddle for me? I cube not one, but eight in pairs of two. Clap your hands and you'll be able to see through. That detective is pretty ignorant. He will never see the answer. Kisses and hugs from the ultimate best dancer? I knew it. This is Miss Fox. What was that? Who wrote this riddle? Did you read it wrong? You foul mouth girl. No, I read exactly what was written here. You know what? I have better things to do than playing detective. Guards, ex execute them both. I want to go home. No way. No, wait. Oh. Good job, guards. Our work here is done. As for you, my girl, you can have this. A bloody bag? Hmm. Wonder what the bloody bag, if I could, like, just mental that bloody bag or not. Let me see. Bloody bag, let's go. Oh, okay. There are two severe arms in there. And a severe leg. Alright, let's see if I can get more parts around here. No parts? No parts. No parts. Okay. So if the mirror lets me through, I got every single part. Yeah. Okay. I think I got everything. Let's test that theory again. Alright. Let's see if it works, shall we? Let's go through. Yes. I got everything. Doo doo doo. Alright, let's go. Doo. Now, 
I think it's about time we uh, put these uh, together, the parts again. So let's see if I could drop it here. Yes, I could. You're going through a lot of trouble for us, miss. I can't thank you enough. Don't worry, Mr. Rabbit. I'll definitely save you both. Thank you, miss. Alright, it's... Okay, how much, how much more we got? Just a fox leg, so I need to drop it off at her seat. Hopefully. Yes, let's drop it. Leave. No, there shouldn't be any items in here. Yep. Alright, let's put you guys back together. Gather enough parts for you and Miss Fox. Hopefully we can fix you with these. You've gone through so much trouble for both of us. I can't thank you enough. I'm just glad I could help you. Tell me, do you know how to sew? Yes, I do. Will you please sew us back together? I wish to be reunited with Mrs. Fox. Of course. Let me just find something to sew you with. Oh, I know. Let's use a need and thread. I mean, needle and thread, I meant. I'll see you first, Mr. Rabbit. Please do, miss. Oh, you're done. Can you move? Oh, my. Yes. Why, yes. Indeed, I can. That's a relief. I'm so glad. Let's so, Mrs. Fox next. Yes. All right, guys. Let's let's sew her now. All right, Miss Fox. I know you're very in the behind those mirrors, but let's sew you. I wonder if she'll wake up now. So, Rabbit. Mrs. Fox, I'm so happy you're all right. I'm so glad. Thank you, Miss. We owe you everything. You're welcome. I'm glad you two can dance again. Here, you can have this. I kept it since the day the others ripped our bodies apart. Acquired a special key. That's the key to the theater. I'm sure it will come in handy. Thank you so much, Mr. Rabbit. Now, Miss Swox, you give me this dance? Yes. Now, I'm so happy I was able to help them. Alright, you both enjoy a dance while I go to the theater. Yeah, the theater. See, I wonder if this the theater or not. Let me check. Item. Let's use our special key. Oh, it is. Let's go. Ooh, look at this. Anything useful? Children books, all right, not useful. Afternoon tea rhymes for children, okay. It's tea and stuff, huh? Anything important back here? Index of a book, which is guide to medical herbs. All right. Coloring books, okay. But none useful to me. Enemy of Melancholy by Robert Burton. Okay. Ooh, could I like all of these? Yes. Alright. Um, okay. Never seen that language before. Read from book. Nothing useful, right? Okay. So I guess let's enjoy the show. And then I can't pronounce that. <laughs> Alright. Let's just sit down um here yes welcome to the most incredible shows the most amazing imp impressive roles of a little girl whose days were counted and none of her wishes ever been granted <laughs> oh and I am an impressive poet. Who are you? Don't trouble yourself with petty questions, miss. But do enjoy your stay and please keep your memories close to your heart. Hey, that's what my mother said. Two, one. Show start. 
Once upon a time, in a very special garden, there was this very special little girl. She loved taking naps aside in the afternoon and doing nothing all day. Such an adorable little slob. In fact, she was such a pretty little girl, she had very, very old mountain sweets. But that's not all. Edgily, her best friends never left her side. Just like sisters from the same mother. Haha, <laughs> I'm hilarious. A noisy little brat and her stuffed doll. What very combination could there be? Together, they were rot. Riot. Known all over the kingdom as supreme rulers. Just two silly little kids. I don't know. Silly little monster. They, know. they told each other many secrets. Embarrassing ones. Tea time was a very important event where they discussed very serious matters. Ooh, which was the funniest pocket in the kingdom, for example? They had also many parties and brains the size of pea. Edgelay was indeed Villa's best friend and her most important companion. She was also stuck with the girl's childless ways. One day, however, it started to rain for and flee from leave the house. What a shame, Fleeta, I mean. <laughs> Inside Fleeta's house, there was a secret place so secret no one could visit it. Nevertheless, the children of Fleeta decided to wander in anyway. If it's not, the little rain could keep them from having fun. Inside the very secret room was a very secret letter. What could it be written the most secret letter, Fleeta wondered? But what's this? They were just filled with lies. Just who had written all those lies? And what were those lies doing inside the room? How could they go there? There was no somebody that flew with Billy's ugly lies. There's no way it's Felipe's fault. It could have been Felipe's fault. That's right. Whew. There's no way Felipe could have been involved in such disabled affairs. Flew was nothing but a pure little girl. There was no way it could have been Felipe's fault. Simply because there was a very clear culprit. It was all that mean girl's fault. The name of that very evil culprit is... Oh my! Things have may have gone interesting. Wait, where do you go? What's going on? Oh, I, I hear some screams. Oh no, don't tell me. The door's unlocked, so... Wow! <laughs> that was a pretty fast reading to for me to catch up, but let's see what happened. Dang! The very same image. Mr. Rabbit, what happened? Isn't it obvious, dearie? We took care of them! You don't mean you've done this yourselves, do you? Why, well, yes, we have. Was that our work done quite beautifully? But why? I thought you wanted one of us to dance again. Oh, sweetie, you have my yet to learn. Apparently, hatred is still one of those things. How can you do something like this? How could we? You are very well aware of what they have done to us, are you not, miss? Still doesn't justify what you've done. How doesn't it justify? French, my dear, is a, is a dish best served cold, do you understand? Now move along, we are very grateful for your good deeds towards us, after all. Oh, you are most pure satisfaction. <laughs> nope, this can't be. Dang, it's just literally the same blood image from the mirror. Okay, now... Where do we need to go again? We just came from there. Uh, let's try going to the right. Yeah. Okay, it's open now. Oh, guys, cats. And now locked. Locked with cats. All right, floor of meow. Shift to 44. All right. Pumpkin. Oh, no, I'm allergic to cats. At you. Oh, you, what, what you... What's that? Oh, a charm. Cool. Alright, guys. Let's save. Do. Alright, cats. What's up? Queen is waiting you. Yes. The queen wants to see me. That's good. Oh, yes. Another charm. Thank goodness. Yep. Queen. Ah, what might be charm you, little girl? I, I don't know, mister. And what might you not know, little girl? I don't know why they do some something like that. I see. Listen, miss. Our resistances, no matter how faint they be, 
they do serve a purpose and will, in one way or another, affect your own. I see. You can have this. I think it might cheer you up a little. A candy cane! Fortunately, I can't accompany you on your journey. I'm sure this will be able to assure you in times of distress. Thank you, mister. You're very kind. Yes, very kind indeed. Perfection! Alright, guys. Let's meet the queen. Alright, queen. What do you need me for? Wow, that's a long red carpet. Impressive! I knew you would be able to reach me. What do you mean? Silence! I have, but a couple of matters to address for you, my girl. Firstly, I'm here by announcing your demise, for you will not be advancing further than this very room. Please wait, you can just silence. Certainly, my dear. Since you'll be soon be disappearing for good, I shall pay you my respects. No. I have had enough of your medical attitude, my girl. I should not tolerate it any further. As much as it is but a foolish gamble, I made my own move. Now it's time for me to make yours. Alright, squeaky. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. Please wait. I need to explain what's going on. God! No, please wait. It's in your hands, my girl. It's your turn to claim what's yours. Oh no. Ah! No, 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 no. What's this? Oh, yeah. Eat! Oh, okay. Oh, thank goodness gracious. I knew that food had something to do with it. Alright, any more? Ha, ha. Yeah, this is my original size right here. You can't defeat me, and I'm going to come for you. Oh no. What was that? Food? But did it taste bad? Wait, where am I? Shh, you shouldn't disturb the dead. The dead? What are you talking about? What is that? No, don't, don't. Oh, what's this? Oh no. What is that? Queen Agilette. Ah, that's the Queen Agilette. Huh. Okay. Pumpkin. Got anything useful for me? I didn't see anything. Don't ask me, it wasn't me. I know it wasn't you, but anything interesting. Man. Ah, here we go. Ooh. So peaceful and pure, just like Sleepy Beauty. Alright. Uh, I know it's a bad idea. Maybe a bad idea, but let's see. Come from this big chest. Okay, I can't. Uh, nah. Yeah, I don't have anything. Gotta keep looking. Let's go over to the right, guys. To the right. Ah, oh, yes, to the right. Here we go. We got three doors. You. Talk to me. Blue? He wants me to go blue. Wants me to go red. There's a note on the table. Hiding my darkened heart in a veil of innocence, I swore. Weeping in the darkness, confiding with the moon. As sun rises, I put on my golden crown once more. Home to meet my beloved by the afternoon. Gold. So, which door though? Let's see, let's go with blue. Nope. Alright, not blue. Let's try red. Let's try red. Still no. Alright, let's try the gold. Go to one. 
Yes. All right, another riddle. I can be stolen or given away, and you will live. Yet you cannot live without me. Okay. So the moon, yeah. But the moon can't be stolen though. The bat, nah. We can live without it. The heart, yeah. We can't. We need our heart to live. All right, next riddle. What letters like a cow's tail? Um, cow's tail. L, maybe. Doesn't look like it. Oh, it's not L. All right, it's not L, guys. A cow's tail is apparently not L. Not L shape. So, hmm, F. Hey guys, something new. A cow's tail is F shaped. Hey, ooh, there's three different keys here, but which one's the right one? Let's see. Red key shaped like a bat. No, we uh, no leave it. Not the bat one. Ah, here we go. So the riddle it contains a heart, um, and then golden, and then the F for the uh, shape of a um, a cow's tail. Let's go. All right, hope hope for it to work. Let's do it. Let's do this, guys. Yes, I know. Now use the um, gold key. Yes, it fits. All right, so who was the funny buddy who locked me inside this chest? You're that girl. Who are you? Oh, I'm. I've never seen you around here before. How did you get here? I just, I see. Do you see who locked me up inside this chest by any chance? Oh no, I didn't. The chest was already locked when I got here. What? That's a shame. Oh well, that's all right. I'm a good detective, so I'll catch a culprit in no time. Ah, uh, I see. So, what are you doing here, miss? That's, uh, <laughs> no, Queen did not invite me, so I'm going. I'm here to play! Oh, I see. <laughs> it's been really hard to get here. I'm surprised. Not at all. You know, I came here to look for Echelette, and all of a sudden I was inside this chest. It's really scary and dark too. By the way, have you seen Echelette? I've been looking for her. Yes. She's in the hallway. Really? Let's go meet her then. I'll introduce her to you. Wait, I... You? No, never mind. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Ah, what's your name, Miss Aflita? Oh, li a princess. Oh, I'm sorry, I, I don't know my own name. Haha. <laughs> what, really? Yes. That's a shame. Now let's go to find a Gillette. Let's. Ain't that good for their same party? Gillette, what have they done to you? We need to save her. But how? Do you want to get on my back? Yes, that might work. Hold me up. Be that, that hurts. Quiet, just hurry. I was there.
Oh, Angelette. Is she alright? Uh huh. I'm glad. But she's ripped apart. Ah, don't worry for that. No, oh, that's so. My thread and needle. You do? Yes. Will you let me try? Alright, but be careful. Of course. So sewing. There, she's already. Wow. <laughs> oh, Angelette, I'm so glad you're right. Everything will be fine now. I'm here with you. What was that? You didn't see who it was. Oh, that's fine. All that matters is that you're safe now. Thank you so much for saving me, Angelette. Oh no, it was nothing. No, no, I insist. <laughs> Gillette and I want to invite you to come play with us at my dollhouse. Would you like to come? Really? Can I? Of course. Come on now, let's go. Your dollhouse, huh? Alright. It's not in charge of chess, is it? I hope not. Okay, it isn't. Step back a little. I'm going to do a magic trick. A magic trick? Do you know how to do magic? Uh-huh. Now watch. Wow, magic. A garden. Yes, this is my absolute favorite place to play. Oh, I see. You need to go through it to reach my dollhouse. Let's go, I'll lead the way. Thanks. Oh, pumpkin charm. It's always important to acquire those, huh? Okay, okay nothing. Nothing. Alright, nothing in this woods, guys. Nothing. Wait, can I get something from the tree? Nope. Alright, let's go ahead.